Israel carried out attacks in Syria and Lebanon overnight. Two Israeli attacks were carried out by the Israeli military within a few hours in one night, learned BulgarianMilitary.com, citing the Israeli online media The Times of Israel. Early this morning, July 20, the Israeli Air Force carried out airstrikes, attacking the warehouses of Iranian-backed militias in the Syrian province of Aleppo. According to the Syrian state news agency Sana'a, ammunition and weapons depots in the city of al safira were attacked, resulting in powerful explosions and explosions. The information was also confirmed by the UK-based Syrian Observatory for Human Rights, SOHR. There is no detailed information on the damage or casualties. Some Syrian sources, including Sana'a, claim that the Syrian air defense system intercepted the surface-to-air missiles fired by the Israeli Air Force, but very often, Sana'a information in subsequent Syrian military reports differ on the effectiveness of air defense systems. Israel has no practice of confirming such actions. Thus, Tel Aviv does not deny but does not verify the news of Israeli strikes on Syrian territory. This passivity is the rule among the Israeli military and governments. Tel Aviv only confirms attacks, airstrikes, and military actions resulting from revenge after an Israeli territory attack. Aleppo is a major province in northern Syria, bordering Turkey. In the past, the Israeli Air Force has carried out airstrikes in the area. It should be noted that this is the first reported Israeli attack in Syria in early June this year. Four hours after the attacks on Iranian warehouses in Syria, two rockets were fired from Lebanon in the direction of northern Israel. The Israeli military confirmed this information, saying that the Iron Dome intercepted one missile while the other had fallen into a field. We remind you that the Israeli Iron Dome air defense system works based on a complex algorithm, and if it calculates that a missile will not fall in a populated, military, or secret area, the system misses the missile, as is the case here. Israel responded to strikes from Lebanon by firing two rockets at the source, attacking Jewish territory. According to the Israeli military, Hezbollah, which operates in Lebanon, was not involved in the attack but was most likely a smaller terrorist group funded by Iran. The area under attack in Lebanon was Wadi Hamol. BulgarianMilitary.com reminds you that several missiles were fired against Israel from this area during the 11-day missile war between Israel and Gaza.